Good morning, everybody. Ah, uh, man, had a rough day yesterday. Uh, my buddy called me and the car broke down and I had to give him a ride to see his kid. Uh, he's got one of those uh, visitation deals. But we're out and about. It's uh, early Sunday morning. And I say I, you know, normally don't get out on Sundays, but this is the third consecutive Sunday. For, well, you know, one reason or another. Anyway, it's uh, 10 15. Been out about 45 minutes. Not much going on. I think it's a little too early. Perfect weather, 75 degrees, a little overcast. You know, uh, not too bad. All right, stay tuned. Gonna make something happen. Gotta help. <laughs> What's going? How you doing, Debbie? Not good. No. What's hey, what is the best transitional program here? Transition from the streets, drugs, whatever. Well, um, there's, I guess you could say, like halfway houses where where you can. You know volunteer and check in one of my friends said that but she had to go to atlanta to do it that's what i'm thinking and i can't he's online i can get more information for you please all right here here's a water for you nice and cold how you guys doing man i love what mommy got i got some food uh dog food okay here you go man thank you sir man how long you guys been out here you got your you're changing locations aren't you did you get kicked out of the other spot? Yeah. They're kicking us out of everywhere here. We have nowhere to go. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm gonna tell you this right now. I was just behind the other Walmart and there's a nice clear path up there. I saw three people walk up into right behind the other Walmart down by, you know, Burger King and Home Depot and you know, all that. This one? Yeah. I can take you for a ride. I can show it to you. Well, that's true, but at the help me with a hotel room. Who would help you with a hotel, boy? There's a lot of churches that do that. We've been together seven years. Yeah. I don't think we've met, buddy. What's your name? That's Mark. 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 I'm Daryl. Nice to meet you, buddy. Let me give you one of my cards because I'm com I'm a complete stranger to you. And that way you can kind of, you know, Debbie can vouch. Here you go, buddy. We've met before, but I can't remember your name. We were Shane over there at the park. My cousin does that. You know, Eagle Neck. What's it, Nick? Eagle Neck. Eagle Neck. He's on YouTube. Live screen, everything. Oh, all right. They got a lot of videos. Well, I'll tell you what. You guys are probably hungry. I got lunches for you. I got some good stuff. Uh, I'll bring I'll bring some over. I got some uh, some Dr. Peppers and some. Or, well, I won't say Dr. Pepper. Let me say Dr. Thunder. Okay. There is a difference. Some people don't like them. Yeah, you know. And I've got a uh, you know now in the lunches there's a, a Kool Aid pouch. You know, it's just cold. It just took it out of the fridge. So you're just doing your journey today, huh? Yeah, I'm just out and about. You're so. Yeah. So. That's all right. I don't well, no, this is a, this no, is a... this is a quicker way to get our kids back, is transit, doing a transitional drug program. Okay. So I have to find us. Now, my problem is, he's on bond, and they don't want to let him go unless I can guarantee us a way back for him to go to court. They ain't even got a court date yet. I would be in and out the program by the time they do show. That's true. Now is this for both of you to check in? We want to go together. Yep. Okay. Well, I would imagine it's going to be sex. We're going to be separated. Yeah, that's what I mean. Okay. You know, it, it, it's all right as long as we do our classes and stuff together and we stay real close where we can see each other, we'll be all right. But you might be a hundred miles apart. No, they got they got they got them in too many places here. Yeah. They got a bunch in Atlanta. Well, I seen you had a couple phones. Yeah, I have a phone now too. Are, are you able to get on yeah, get I online and check it out? I, I, but we haven't had no 
phone because they, they're just been dead. I can't always charge my little charger and my phone. All right, I got just a thing for you. You got your cables and stuff? All right, give me a minute. I'll be right back. If you guys want, if you want to come around and get off the street, okay, you know. Or you want to meet us at the park? Well, I was just there. That's a long walk back. That's where I first saw you guys, and then I drove back through the park, and you were gone. Uh, and I was getting books for the kids. Well, do you want to go back to the yeah, park? We'll go back. We'll go back. Yeah, we can go back to the park. You you want to go like underneath the pavilion? Yeah. yeah. All right. Then I'll meet you over there in a few minutes. All right. Thank you. All right. Well, you got some drinks on the way. Yeah, thank you. All right. I'll see you in a little bit, Deb. Could you imagine, guys? Just walking the street, moving from one place to another. Boy, oh boy. Yeah, I'm gonna go set these people up. I'm gonna go meet them at the park. It must be a half a mile from where they just were, give or take. Yeah, we were right on the main road here. Not a good spot. Lots of uh, traffic and, uh, you know, what you might say, you know, the law. But, uh, all right, man. Uh, we're going to be back in a minute. We're going to, I'm going to try to see what I can do to help these guys. All right, see you in a bit. Walking into Brookwood Park. And uh, the people I were just talking to, Debbie and Mark and their friend with their dog. Man, I forgot the dog food. I'll be back. It'll be just a minute. But uh, man, what a nice day. Well, just in general, but not for these guys. Hey man, how you guys doing? Oh, uh, he wants a cola. A regular cola. It doesn't matter. One of us will drink it. Well, I got the Dr. Thunder also. Okay, one of us will drink it. He'll drink the Yoo-Hoo. I know what he wants. Okay. You want the yoo -Hoo? Yes. All right. Here you go, buddy. Here's a yoo -Hoo for you. Thank you. All right. Well, I'll, I'll tell you what. I'll leave these here and you guys can decide. And there are some three pretty badass lunches here. You, your little lunches are always good. Yeah. Well, I try, you know. Um, I'm gonna have to go back to my car because I forgot the dog food. See, that's what I was talking about, that battery. Mm -hmm. Is it a, oh, how convenient is that? I don't know if it works though. We're fixing to find out though. Yeah. Well, um, charge a battery first. I'm gonna charge them both if it works. You got another charge? Oh, yeah. Well, absolutely. Now, I need another charger because we have two phones, but we only have the two and this. I actually have another phone too, but. And that was the battery that I had given to Buford that you oh, had. This is the battery you got, yep, for me, yep. Yeah, yeah, I could see it's really low. Yeah, it's not been charged in two days. Somebody's all angry. But I did, I got you, you, you said you needed a lunchbox. Yes. Okay, a friend of mine sent me some lunchboxes. Okay. And I got some in the car. Okay. And uh, you needed a. a question. Can you get me a wagon? That wheel's about to bust. It might not make it to where I gotta go. It'd be easier to get another wheel. Find a lawnmower. What was that? Find another um, lawnmower's got solid wheels. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, you're talking about wanting to change them to just like solid rubber? Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, the, instead of the hollow plastic. <laughs> I, made the same way. Yeah, I, I can't the complain. It's, it's, it's made its $10. That looks like Charlie's old buggy. I think I'm gonna take the siding off of it and put me some hooks on it. So I can hook my ropes and stuff to it, and I'll walk home. Okay. Walmart, about. I don't know. I'm gonna try to get one at Walmart. They're only like, I don't know, thirty dollars, forty dollars. What is it now? The uh, little wagons at Walmart. They're like thirty bucks. Okay, man. I had some many months ago. Um, a woman in New Jersey, uh, Lauren. She had sent me. Uh, four or five of them them buggies mm -hmm. with the you know the vinyl sides they were pretty cool very cool yes they are all right i'll tell you what man let me run back to the car and i'm going to get you um those lunch boxes and i was going to say how's that battery okay man is it charging mm -hmm. 
It just takes forever. No, I don't see the blue light flashing. Nope, it don't work. That's sweet. Yeah, you might have to press a reset button. Is it is your phone charging? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a bunch of goodies in there. This party mix stuff, you guys are gonna enjoy that. Here you go, young man. Right. Yeah, there's Pop Tart in there. There's a pack of tuna with a fork. Because I was gonna say, if you want, I, I I got a I got a brand new battery, just exact same one. Now it's now it's doing something. Well, it said it had three. That means this cord's no good or this box is no good. Okay, one of the two. Well, you can you can easily tell because you can you can swap this cord. I will. And uh. Because now my phone's even charging. All right, good. Yeah, I didn't see the blue lights flashing. Got some experience with those guys. Yeah, that's a double thick bologna with some some real cheese. You know the stuff that actually melts when you cook it. <laughs> you know, instead instead of you know McDonald's. But uh, all right. Well, give me a second. I'll I'll come right back. Okay. Let me get Shiloh some grub. Okay. And uh, he really looks like he needs some. Well, I, I swear he eats. I swear he does. Well, no, that I believe one right it. There takes a bite of anything. That one gets a bite. I don't so, care what it is. One for you, one for me. Yeah. Well, that one right there. Mm -hmm. Well, what's that one right there's name? Ben. Ben. All right, I've heard your name talked about in a good way. I'm on okay. YouTube too. Yeah. All right, you're the okay. Somebody else. Maybe that's why. That's why. I don't do videos that like that, but what? I got a channel. Fantastic. Well, good deal. All right, I'll be right back, man. Give me a few minutes. Okay. And uh, this is a great spot. I'd hang out right here for as long as you possibly could. Yeah. They're going to run you out at about 30 minutes later, an hour. We were all under the bridge the other night, and uh, they come and ran us out from under there, too. Under, underneath the bridge of Providence? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Every they're. Uh, got killed, yep. Yeah. Yeah. The, I did a video with her. Did you? Yeah. About three weeks before she was murdered. Fortune cookie, man. You gotta crack them open. You gotta tell me what's going on there. You gotta read your fortune to the world. You need some profound statements. All right. Yeah, they're right on top. All right, I'll be right back. I'm gonna get you guys some more stuff. Okay. All right, see you in a minute. Man, that's what I was talking about. You know, I don't know, last week or so sometime. One of the other videos about you know police enforcement's cracking down and then somebody made a comment about well yeah the supreme court passed this law about the homeless and you know what you know what i really wanted to say i watched the uh presidential debate last i think it was tuesday i don't know five days ago whatever it was anyway i was really hoping that they would address the homeless situation that would have been that would have been uh interesting you know i really don't understand how people can do this it's truly amazing to me you know and i think i got problems or you know you may think you got problems they would trade you in a heartbeat okay miss debbie now this is for young Shiloh, an extra water. Now I've got two bags of okay. some, some gravy train. These are one pound bags each. Okay. Where's your puppy today? Oh, he's at the house. Okay. He's on strike. Hey, you get any, I, cause I'm sure you probably round up all kinds, can you round up anything? Um, <laughs> I need a extra large kennel. Extra large kennel? Mm -hmm. hmm. It's gotta be for the big dogs. Because he's not he ain't but a year old. He's not even a year old yet. Yeah. Look at him paws. Yeah, he's gonna be a beast. Or she, is she, right? No, it's a he. I thought it was Shiloh. Let me tell you, he is our everything. He he's originally was my son's gonna be service dog. 
Then he become my other daughter's emotional support dog. And now I think he's my emotional support. Well, you got to take everybody. care of them. This is a can opener, guys. Okay. It's totally portable. Yes. You might want to stash that away. Have you ever seen that before, Mark? Yep. All right. All right. Those are pretty awesome. Um, my buddy, uh, my buddy Dean sent those, okay. and I I did get you a, a shirt. Thank you. You had asked for a shirt, and I got your lunchbox. That's a long sleeve. It should fit you just just fine. It will. And now there are three individual lunch bags. Okay. You guys can mix and match the colors. I'll set one. Oh. Glad it was closed. Cool. And one from Mr. Ben. And these are some rain ponchos. We, we, we might need them. Uh, well, need the pink one, Mark. A, well, it's uh, uh, tell you what. Yeah, there's three of them. Thank you. Because you guys never know when you got to pick up and leave, and it might nope. be. We don't. Feels like we got a storm coming in right now. So, what'd you think of that tuna, Ben? Oh! What'd well, you do with the tuna? Put it on your sandwich with your bologna? Well, there's a separate fork and a separate pouch of the tuna, you know, in each of the deals. My friend Angela sent those. You, know. you get a lot of your stuff by donation. All of it. You know, that's the only way. I, I was going to say, make sure you're getting your donations because they're yeah. out there. We used to volunteer for a place in uh, Severn Hills, Florida. Um, you were telling me you were like a manager there, you know. I was just part of all of it. I used to go out and do the homeless cat count. We both did. Yeah. Um, I'll have to look you that picture up. We were out. Um, we found a tunnel one year. Really? People were living under. Yeah. Yep. Um, Holy cow. They. It, it was. It was a pretty cool experience. So you two have been together seven years. Almost seven years. Yep. Wow. And you need to get into treatment together. Because I know that you had a rough time, you know, they took your kids. That's why we're trying to get into a treatment. Yeah. Now, is that your kids, both of you? Yeah. Well, okay. some of them are. The <laughs> other ones are mine. Well, this was visitation the other day. Yeah, you say you... Today's my daughter's birthday. Today's your daughter's birthday. Well, happy birthday. What's her name? Brooklyn. Brooklyn? Mm -hmm. Well, happy birthday, Brooklyn. Yeah. Here's Brooklyn. She's seven... Seven today. Today. Wow. That was a mess too. They're all. They're, I Can you call mess. her? No. Nope. Not allowed to, or you just can't do it. They won't let me. I was able to talk to them, and then they stopped it. They're. I don't. I don't know what their problem. That's bullshit. Is. That's why the best thing for me to do is get us in a program. Well, let's uh, let's make a plan to try to move forward. If, uh, oh boy, I really wouldn't even know where to start. I would imagine, doesn't, you know, DFS, don't they have programs, you know, or referrals to call? What about, you know, the churches? I, I'm waiting on um, the defects lady to open her office tomorrow. Um, I think I'm going to cancel my visitation tomorrow to try to get us in a program. I can't do these streets no more. You know, that girl wasn't very far from here when she got hurt. No. And, you know, that's really sad. I was out here by myself at that point in time. And then, you know, my kids, I want them home. I don't know how, I don't know how to function. Does that, I mean, I know how to get up and get dressed, but no. not really. Like, I'm used to yeah, getting up and it's, getting dressed. And you you wake up and it's just, it's, different. it's such a disappointment, it's, you know, and you're like, what the hell am I going to do? And then they, they they only show up when they want to and give you visits when they want to i can't do all that my babies are my everything that is horrible man and if i could get help to get out find a place i wouldn't even need to go in a treatment but isn't the treatment part of the thing why you would be able to, to see your patient. okay i don't have to go through inpatient but if it takes me to go to an inpatient to hurry this up so i can be with my babies I'm down. Yeah. That, uh, Brooklyn and, I mean, Audrey and Leland have never been away from me. I bet you I can count on my hands and toes how many babysitters they've had in the last seven years, Brooklyn. Oh, I boy. I do have socks. You, you. you got long ones? 
I, I have the long ones at home, but that's I, I'm preparing for winter, you know, coming up. But, you know, I got. He just got new boots yesterday. Sweet. Yeah, I got boots in there kind of rubbing. Okay, I'll tell you what. Let me let me see what I can find out. Okay. Let me go to look. I'll take a look on the chariot. Is that your car now, though? Yeah. That, okay, I was for some reason thinking you had a white SUV. I don't know. No, it's just, well, I got as much shit as an SUV. <laughs> <laughs> All packed into a compact Honda. Well, hey, well, them Hondas, I don't be talking smack now. Them Hondas are good cars. I love it. Look, yeah. I have a Toyota that I can't get someone. I need someone to put a water pump. You need a water to pump, yeah. But you can't fix pump. it on site. I have water. I have all the everything for it. I already bought it. It's sitting in the truck. The guy's going to end up towing it if I don't hurry up and move it. I got to find somewhere to move it to until I can find someone to fix it. Okay, but you can't fix it on site. They won't let you work on it there. That doesn't seem to make much sense. If they want it out of there, no, it's like, it's well, just well, hey, yeah. That way. Okay. Well, let me go look. Uh, I'll grab some socks for you guys. Okay, thank you. And uh, we'll go from there. I'll be right back. Okay, guys. I come bearing gifts. Right off the bat, we got some yes, hands. Yeah. What is it? Um, hand sanitizing wipes. Oh yes. Yeah, but here's a couple hand cranking flashlights. Oh yes, okay, we need thank them. You. You, you. you know, there's a handle that pops out, and you just crank them up, and they'll, they'll power up for you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I used to have one of them. Well, a long time ago. So you get three, you know, travel together then. Pretty much. Okay. He, he actually has a place to stay. He just sleeps out here with us. Oh. He, he is actually, he babysits Shiloh when I have to go to visit. He keeps the dog so I can go to my visits to see my babies. Okay. Well, here are two pair of the, the short ankle socks. but And I did find a bunch of the long pair. Oh, yeah. The of, uh, these are heavy duty now. There's five pair there. And those are uh, those are thermal. But I, I got a pack of uh, their cigars. Okay. My friend Darlene had sent these. They're okay. cigar cigarettes. They're not bad though. Okay. You know. Thank you. And then Mark, you might find these handy. Um, oh yeah, he will. Let me uh, let me pull them out here. I've had these for a little bit of a spell. It's kind of a two-piece deal. An extra large long sleeve uh, yes. T-shirt, but also it's more like a legging, a legging style pants, yes. like the ones you had got before. Mm -hmm. But these are kind of like guy style because they got yeah. the, you can see they got the, you know, the male genitalia opening type yeah, I thing. I might pop mine out. I might get going. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Don't mind me. No, don't worry about it. I got to keep coming. coming. Well, enjoy your lunch, Debbie. Thank you. Nice to meet you, Mark. You Glad I could help you out, man. When are you coming? Oh, I, there's no set. Time or schedule. Can you, you know. try to round me up a wagon? I can try. I, I can't make any guarantees whatsoever. Yeah, because I found oh. one. They're because of the WalMarts here. They're forty nine dollars instead of thirty nine dollars. If you wait and order it, well, I might be able to have it shipped. In well, what a. I mean, if you want to check yourself in the treatment, you're not going to need I'm a still wagon. I need it to get laundry to where it needs to go. I have all the kids. When I get them back, it, it will be used. Believe me. Okay, but that's a while away. I know. Yeah. They've only been gone two months, and the judge keeps telling me it's not going to be long. My whole thing is, I need help finding a place to live outside of here. I can't. Yeah. Well, do you get a check? He does. The kids. Some of the kids do. Okay. It's four hundred dollars a week in a hotel room. Oh, I know. It's crazy. Yeah, it's ridiculous. You know, it's uh, the guy you buy the balls and they know it, mm -hmm. you know, and it's like too bad. Yep. Somebody else will do it. You know, if, if you can't afford it, see you later. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, I know I know the drill. That's messed up, guys. All right. Well, I hope I could put some smiles on your face today. You good? You know. If you know. I keep him out my lunch bag, I'd be doing it. <laughs> if you can keep out of your lunch. Mm hmm she says you're gonna invade her lunch. You will. So you got, all right. Eating all my snacks. Well, there's a lot of grub in there. As you guys dig through, they're like, "Oh, I didn't see that. I didn't see this." Yeah. But um, yeah, if you need help doing any of that, 
Okay. I did a lot of stuff there. Y'all don't do a uh, homeless count here? I have no idea. Yeah. You know, the, 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 they, they, they do their own thing. Whether they do a count or, yeah, they count them when they bring them to jail. <laughs> You know, <laughs> That's about I mean, I don't know what else to tell you. Otherwise, you know, I you can't even look up if you try to look up, you know, Whitfield County, you know, City of Dalton, you know, Hamilton County homeless, nothing. Mm -hmm. You know, no no numbers, no results, no percentages. You know, there's 110,000 people in Whitfield County, 35,000 in Dalton City, and half of them are probably homeless or a paycheck from being homeless. Well. Yeah, that's that quite you know very well could be the case. You know, and they keep hollering. Well, you gotta have a job. You gotta have a job. You gotta have a job. Well, um, great. Find me a place so I can go and take a shower every day and get up and go to work. I'll go get a job. I don't got yeah. a problem. I need to be presentable. I can't be going in wearing you know dirty clothes and you know stinking. I'm not walking around in dirty clothes. I promise yeah. that. But you look very nice today, by the Thank way. Thank you. Yeah. Um, another thing. Do you ever get baby wipes? Uh, occasionally. Occasionally I do. Last set I had given out was in Chattanooga. A guy had a three-year-old. And, uh, uh, what was his name? It doesn't matter his name. But anyway, that was the last pack that I had. And the reason why I said, I asked that is because a lot of the girls out here, well, let me rephrase that, some of us take a bath with them. Yeah. They some well, don't, but that's their business. Yeah, that's their business. Yeah. But I go through more baby. I use baby wipes for everything, though. Yeah, everything. Okay. Well. Uh, I was just thinking of something that. Plus, they smell nice. Yeah. You know, they got that clean smell about them. I use but, uh, baby wipes for everything. When I get on my feet, I'll get you a case of them. They feel like $16, $17 for a case. Don't worry about it. When I get on my feet. And okay. It ain't going to take me but a minute. I just gotta have somewhere to go, you know. It's not like, oh, I want to give you my new number. My oh, so you got a text now number? No, I got a real number now. Oh, I moved up in the world. Yeah, <laughs> moving on up. One step like, at a time. like the Jeffersons. One step at a time is all I feel like. Oh yeah, I love that show. Oh, the Jeffersons are is, is awesome. I had a big ass sharpie. I'm trying to find it. Oh, and I also got you a little pack of, uh, oh, thank you. from Loretta, some triple antibiotic ointment. Yes, thank you. In case you're running any, you know, generic wounds. I know what you're running to out here. See, I told you. And some hydrocortisone cream from my friend Darlene. I need some, um, what is that stuff we need? Uh, muscle rub. Yes. Oh, you're talking like uh, icy hot or, yes. you know, something. Yes, we got some called uh, Blue Stop. Oh, that stuff's awesome. It, yeah. It's, it, that stuff's awesome. It's stuff's awesome. But I don't got it up here. What's my phone number? It's down in Florida. <laughs> it's in our store. It's down in Florida. So. If you hear okay. anything, please. well, since you got a real phone, now let me give you one of my cards. You know, I know everybody else has got one. You may have one from back in the day, but on there, on the bottom, my contact is my email address. Okay. Yeah, you can contact me on there. Okay. I get a billion calls, not a billion, but quite a bit of calls every day, and it's like if I don't know the number, I just can't answer them. Yeah. You know, it's it could uh, be. Put that in your phone, and if you hear anything, and. One of the stipulations for him not getting them not wanting him to go is just transportation from wherever he's at here. Somebody can't Uber him in so he can go to court. He's going to change. A transitional program is a life change. Yeah. It's not that you just go in there and okay, you, you do a drug class. It doesn't it doesn't work like that. A transitional program. You live it. From, yeah. Changes you from the way you get up and get dressed every morning to. So how you go to bed at night it gets you a job it gets you i told you um you know it gets you a job it, it could get me a better job than i can get now you know i can go to mcdonald's and work in, in any city sure but who wants to go to work at mcdonald's yeah i mean i will i don't got a problem working at McDonald's. you want a job that you can call you know perhaps a, a career yeah, something. you know something you could have long term mm -hmm. you know you know insurance and whatnot i get it i get it Totally. 
All right, man. Well, I'll let you guys get to it. Uh, Thank you very much. You are very welcome. And uh, well, I'm glad I spotted you today. I you know. <laughs> just look just look for the wagon with the flat tire that looks like a seven inch seven inch tire mm. hard to say mark look it up and see how much tires are for it well it's in order to get one you know to order it it'll be probably a while for that particular buggy oh you know well i'll tell you what if you find out email it to me okay yeah it's on my car well, I think I think um, it would be just as easy. Uh, it would actually be better to put rubber on it. Yeah. But well, then you got to change all four. Well, you don't technically have to. Oh well, yeah. yeah I, I suppose. I'm. Because you know it's it's going to be a matter of time before the other ones go. Yeah, I paid ten dollars for that and just bought it off some dude that needed some money for cigarettes and I needed a wagon. So. Yeah. It's not the first one I bought like that. Yeah. Sounds like a fair trade. Whatever. All right. He was a homeless guy, you know. He needed cigarettes and something to drink, and I needed a wagon. I'd be interested to see where he got it because that looks like my friends. Uh, he said out of the garbage. Because that was one well, of the Well, that's, that's the common answer. I got it out of the garbage. I found it. Most, you know. uh, most of them around here do go dumpster diving. Though, so. Well, yes. they might go diving, but it doesn't necessarily mean they're going to find a wagon. Mm -hmm. you know. Ooh, I mean, I, if they're going to if they're going to just... <laughs> If somebody walked up to me and said it was their wagon, I'd give it back to them. Well, let me let me let me ask you this: Does it make sense to say that they found this in the garbage versus just on the side of the road? Why would someone take the time that was going to give it away or lose it or throw it away? Why would they go all the way to a dumpster to just throw it out? Why wouldn't they just leave it? They would just leave it on the side of the road. Yeah, there you go. That's my point. Uh oh. It's okay. That's oh. okay. Oh no, he don't. He, he's funny. If ever get his hair to grow back would be okay. Shy, shy. shy. He's all Mom's fired. <laughs> He's all fired up. All right, guys. Thank you. We'll have a blessed day. You know. We will try. Yeah, no doubt. No doubt about it. If you hear of any programs that will take us both, and even like if I have to go rent a motel room for you know a month, that's fine. To to get us in whatever we got to do, it, it's just there. There's not enough of money to keep paying it right this minute. Yeah. You know. No, I totally understand, but you, you're going to make a lot more headway by, you know, calling around and to. That's what I've been doing. Yeah, especially and I like. on it too, so. Call the health department. Yeah, I didn't think about that one. Yeah. Oh boy. Shiloh. So. Nobody's even around. Oh, he sees, he, he sees that other dog over there. And normally he don't do that. Normally he'll walk by them and not, don't even Push care it. that they're there. Push it. Yeah. Push it. Hey. Tyler, hey, hey. Here, Uncle Ben will feed you, hand feed you like he normally does. <laughs> Uncle Ben, yeah. Boy, he, Uncle Ben. Yeah, he's been Look, going. Uh, ben, did you eat some dog food too? Yeah, he's going through it. Yeah. Yeah. We got to pick on each other. We, we, <laughs> yeah, you know, you got to. No, uh, it's you got to have your gotta your have own something. source of humor for sure. Now I need a, bit, a big bag. Push it. There's not much more going to fit in my purse okay. either. I like the the body harness. You know, that's that's pretty good. Doesn't pull out of it. Yes, he uh. does. Yeah. Oh, well. Shiloh. All right, hey. guys. I'm gonna get going. I'm gonna I'm gonna let you carry about your business. Enjoy your enjoy your lunch. Thank you. You man. barely you barely ate. I will eat. You might want to you might want to take advantage of that while you still can. No, no, I will yeah. eat. My nerves gotta calm down though. All right, guys. Mark, nice to meet you, sir. Hey, you too. Ben, good to see you, buddy. All right, you take care of these uh, these young whippersnappers. Oh, he so. will. <laughs> All right, guys. All right, have a blessed day. All right, yeah. Like I said, my email's on there. Get a hold of me. Okay. If you guys get in a pinch or something, you know, just let me know. I'll see what I can do. Okay. So. A room would be amazing. Well, yeah. You know, <laughs> it's just. It's not anything I could do about that part of it. You know. Well, you know, you never know who's going to call you and say, hey, uh, I want to donate, you know, and people donate all kinds of crazy stuff. That's true. Know. Oh, for sure. For sure. Well, we'll see. Thank all right. You. But now that I have your phone number, if something does happen, you know, that on my end, I can give you a call and say, hey, you know, I'm over here or there. How long is your phone service good till? Uh, right around the first. 
It will be vaped. Okay. I ain't going to leave that. All right, so you got, let's see here. Today is the 14th, 15th, so about two weeks, beep, you know. Okay. All right. It will get paid. That's one thing we make sure we pay. Yes. The only reason why I didn't have one last month is my daughter shut my phone off. Uh-oh. Because it was under her name because she had to have a bill to go to school, and she shut my phone off. All right. Then I will, uh... I'll, 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 I'm sure I'll talk to you again. I'll, I'll yeah. reach out to you later. Yeah. All right. Have a good day, guys. Oh, man, that's rough. That is so rough. I feel so helpless. You know, what can I do? I'm just a guy. I make 13 bucks a day. I'm sorry, 12 $12 a day putting up videos. It was great, you know, six months ago. A lot more when I you know got more subscribers and views and but it's really died down you know I'm not crying I'm just telling you the facts but uh all right I'm gonna uh gonna skedaddle boy what a what a rough deal all right gonna shut down man hopefully I can get this to you tonight guys it's gonna be a long one all right, boy, sad. All right, I'll see you.